Hello besties, welcome back onto the channel. So on today's video, we're gonna be delving into another design challenge within the Happy Home Paradise DLC, which is the really cool four x four challenge that's just been going around recently. I've been seeing so many videos on this and seeing so many pictures and everything, and I've been really, really excited to give it a go. So we're gonna do a couple of different villagers' houses and try and decorate in a four x four space. <laughs> Are you okay? And on that note, we'll go and catch up with Lottie and uh, go and get decorating. <laughs> so out of the villagers here, we're doing freckles. We have to. I think we'll do coach as well because they don't really want to do coaches. So doing it in a smaller space might be fun. Um, all the fast food could be cute. And then maybe we'll, we'll also do Porsches. I'm going to start with my little baby freckles. She's so cute. Okay, I want to try and stick with their themed ideas that they have, but do it in a 4 by 4 area. I don't really have particular items that I want to make sure that we get down i wouldn't mind like making sure we get a bed and maybe like a small kitchen but i would like to keep them with their like ideas and then maybe we'll do something on the room sketch of something that i would make we're only gonna do one level home for this one a tiny little four by four little home okay so i'm gonna have a quick look at the items um because some of these things we're not going to be able to fit in the house i'm definitely going to try and put some stuff out the front because i still want her to be able to have all the items that she wants there we go. I think we'll leave it like that at the front. Very simple. Not a lot to it, but let's head on inside and change the room size and uh, see what we're working with. <laughs> I'm both excited and scared for this challenge because like love this sort of stuff, but also what if I can't make it look good? <laughs> it's such a cute little space. Like there's definitely potential. It's very much like a studio vibe to it, I feel. Okay, well let's check flooring and wallpaper, see what sort of vibe we can go with. Um, not a tremendous amount. <laughs> I mean, that's not bad. Maybe we could do this and have like, realize this partition wall is not really gonna be able to get the feel that I want. The only reason the partition wall is not going to give me the vibe that I want is because it's only a 4x4 and I kind of want to have one on either side, but it doesn't work that way. So we're stuck like this. I think the smaller ones look better. Okay, let's check on the like items that they want. I like that. Oh, yo, that flooring is fun. Now it just looks like a funky little like bedroom. I kind of want to get her photo up there. I reckon that'll look cute. Or an even like a little sea globe. Yeah, this is like a funky little bedroom, I reckon. The space is limited um okay so we could put like the kitchen here maybe this partition wall thing is just not working out maybe if we like that still looks nice we don't even need to have a partition wall like we could just have a cute little blue room yeah why don't we just do that and then we can decorate it a bunch okay i really i don't want this kitchen i think i just want like a cute little compact kitchen um and i really want to get a bed in here so we'll see just like a, a small little single bed maybe something that we can like kind of decorate in a sense really really struggling my brain here uh what a simple bed because we can get the frame to be like a pink or a blue now here's where the brain comes into play. <laughs> here's where everything happens. You can get a couple of makeshift panels in here. Um, we're not going to be able to fit both of these in here, which really sucks because it kind of makes an awkward spacing. But we could get a small little kitchen in here. Like we could truly just get a sloppy sink in like a little compact kitchen. Uh, maybe in like a... The light blue is cute. And then it would just, we could just have it up against this wall. It would just make it a little awkward in the sense of it's only like a half tile that you have to like move across. Let's change these over. I just want like blue or pink. I feel like now we're going with a blue theme. I feel like now everything is blue. Or should we make everything pink? 12 seconds later. Honestly, none of this is working out together and this is stressing me out. I don't like it at all. I think I think we need to go for a pink theme. I think the blue is just tripping me out too much. But it also, like, it doesn't go with, like, the theme that we've been given from Freckles at all. Do I care? A little. I love Freckles and I want to do her proud. The cherry blossom flooring is so cute. I really like the cherry blossom flooring. What wallpaper have we got? This is very not beach-like, but honestly, I don't 
I don't care at this point. I do care a little, but Freckles is pink and I didn't expect Freckles to have such a, like, the particular theme that they had. Yeah, I think I like this wallpaper and then maybe we can do exposed brick on one side or this common wall just to, like, hang stuff up. Change this over to pink. Okay, maybe we do that and then we'll get a little TV in here. Um, have we got a different... TV. I'm, I really want like a cuter TV. Like you know on Sims you've got the little like penguin looking TV. I want something like that in Animal Crossing. Please. Okay well this kind of goes with like all the iridescent stuff. We'll probably get like a Pisces lamp in here. I think that would still be cute. I still kind of want froggy chair in here. We'll fit this lamp somewhere and then we can put like a bookshelf or something on the back wall or we could even do this like shell partition. Oh god, there's just no space. Okay, well it doesn't fit that way. It doesn't really fit that way either though. I don't like this. Kind of like enjoying the concept that we have going, um, but we need different vibes. Maybe we could put like a little wardrobe or something. Kind of want to fit like as much as we can, but also not as not a lot, if that makes sense. Even these cute little dreamy shells. Okay, that could work. We could get like a little, yeah, like we could still get a little seashell rug in there right under her bed. That still works. This is kind of working out a lot better. That kind of looks nicer. Okay, we'll do this one because then this ties in with the like this. We'll do some wall accessories. I do still want to like be able to give her the sort of stuff that she wants. So we'll get like some fish stuff going up in the back here. Girls can like to fish and be cute as shit as well, you know? Yeah, it's a little like sea fish everything homage. <laughs> the sound that he makes, oh my gosh. This is kind of cute without the like lights on, just the lights from the ceiling. Oh, can we get a soundscape in here? Yeah, we'll get and she's listening! That's so cute! Get a little ocean soundscape in here. Because like this can still be that she lives by the ocean, but she's just got a cute little pink shack. We can we can make it happen if we believe. <laughs> you just have to believe. Okay, well, I kinda think this is cute. You've got a little bed here, a little lamp, you've got some irons, a little radiator, all of the little uh little gyroids. Um, and then like you can still sit and eat here and watch TV and come and you cook here and you can sleep and everything here. I think for the first time in a very long time, I'm gonna do some polishing. And I think that's it. Yeah, I think we're done with our first 4x4 build. I'm pretty happy with it. I think I would have been, it's very out of my comfort zone. I think it would have been a lot more in my comfort zone doing a very like cottage core theme thing. I'm very excited to see the ending for it. Freckles is so insanely cute. I freaking love her so much. Okay, let's see how this montage goes. It's got a cute little entrance shot. Very, very cute. An underwater utopia. I love it. Oh my God, this is, this is cute. I don't feel like there can be any bad photos, really. Oh, I, <laughs> I'm, yep. Oh my God, stop. So cute, so cute. So cute. Yes, I'm gonna hang out a little bit just to get the photos right, but oh my god, look at this freaking cutie. We use the first one so we can show off the entire room, but that photo, that is my favorite photo ever. Look at her, she just looks so happy. I love Freckles so much. Okay, I definitely want to do another house for sure. Oh my god, yo, 80 vacation homes. <laughs> Why there's so much space for me hanging out the front. All around me are familiar faces, worn out. Besties, I'm mad. So I went and did Teddy's house and I pressed start recording on my OBS and I was just real vibing. We were doing like a shitty little apartment decor. So we had like envisioned literally just moved out of home, you know, into a new little house, places filled with boxes, super freaking cute and everything. And then I looked over and my OBS was glitched because no matter if you press start recording, it didn't record at all. So that's a Kitsu dum dum. It's fine. No matter. We're just going to finish off decorating. Um, and then we'll show you the... Thank you. 
the full thing. This place can be Pog and have air conditioning though. And then maybe we'll give it a little hanging plant for like its own little pizzazz. We might hang up some of the clothes that they want. And then I really wanted to put some socks on the floor. I think you can walk over the socks. And then we'll quickly add some good old lights in here. I think there was one particular light that they want. We could make this really gloomy. No, we won't make it super gloomy. But we could. Oh my god, yes, this. Oh, that's so, this is so iconic. Yes! Oh, this is so just like moved into your first home that is like 50 years old. I love this. This is such a cool idea. It's ready, Teddy. It's ready, Teddy. Yo. I'm so excited to show off this one. I'm still will never recover from the fact that it wasn't recording, but hey, I did it. <laughs> Oh, this is cute. It's Teddy's butt! Oh, I'll try to look this way. Very cute, very cute. Teddy stayed in one spot the entire time. Oh, he turned on the vacuum. Bestie, you shouldn't have the vacuum running. Okay, we'll quickly, we'll use this first photo so you can encapsulate the entire place. And then I'll leave you to finish moving in, Teddy. Hand on back. Uh, just don't forget to turn off your vacuum. You vacuum the house, vacuum your rugs and stuff. Uh, finish moving in and turn off the vacuum. Okay, I think we'll use the room design feature for once. I'm sorry, coach. I know that I said I would decorate your house, but it's just not happening. <laughs> I've never probably used this feature before, so it's really, like, nice to, I guess, figure it out. And I guess we'll do something really like cozy cottage core like um maybe something similar to like what's in my house and all uh kind of just head empty no thoughts maybe we'll get like a wood wall yeah i like this i'm trying to like not ponder on it too much okay as for like items i think we will use the simple bed Oh, the ranch stuff really would just suit in with a little like kitchen cottage core thing. Maybe we could do dark brown with like hints of pink, something that I would have in my little house if I had a little house. Um, we'll get a little kitchen in here. I think we could do like a, this could be like a, a studio. I want to get a desk in here. Um, maybe we could fit a fridge and like just a fridge or this little ranch kitchen. We'll put the ranch kitchen in and see how we feel about it. But I do want the desk. I kind of want this. Okay, let's envision this cottage core streamer. Like, if I could have a cute little studio house, what would I want it to look like? And the answer is this. So I know I have the like desk, the streamer, big gamer boy desk somewhere. Uh, I kind of want to go a light blue. Wait, I wanted to change the monitors. Why is this the hardest choice I've ever had to make? You know what? We'll go a first person game. Oh, this is just sort of like changed the vibe of the entire house now. This theme makes no sense whatsoever. <laughs> Maybe we change it up a little bit. Maybe we do really like bank on this like blue cute aesthetic sort of thing. I want to get a small table and chairs, table and chair maybe in here. This is just like really challenging you to work with the space. Yeah, this could work. Um, <laughs> I'm focusing so much on this right now. If I had a mini house, what would I want it to look like? I would definitely want froggy chair, not gonna lie. I don't know if this is the vibe, but this is a, a tough challenge. Okay, and then this is like very studio-like, but we'll put a little table here and then we can put a TV on the wall. And then we got to get cute background streamer set up. That's cute. I'm actually surprised that this Room Sketch app doesn't get spoken about more. It's a really nifty little app. Hells yeah, this is, this is Kitsu's uh, cottage course streaming room. This would never exist in real life. This is just like everything is in one place. If you have a one bedroom little place and this is all you could put in there, this is what you would put in there. But anyway, that is it for this video. I really enjoyed the 4x4 challenge. I highly recommend having a look at it. 
if you are like stuck on ideas or really stuck with decorating um, it really challenges you and like really puts you out the box so I highly highly recommend giving this challenge a shot if you do give this challenge a shot please feel free to jump into the discord the link is in the description and share your creations that you made in the discord or you can pop them on twitter and just tag me at TV. I would love to see what you guys come up with it's a very very cool thing but anyway on that note guys I will catch all of you on my next video bye everybody